Vocaloid. Oh, right. Right now, I'll show you a really great weird transpose phrase in Vocaloid 5. And in the end, it'll sound like this. <laughs> So this is what we'll do. We'll simply use the transpose function in Vocaloid 5, although we'll use it in a way so the phrases are in line with all of your chords. Not solely the key of the music, but every single chord being played, and it's very simple how to do this. Right now I have a blank project in the Vocaloid 5 editor, and the editor is now opened as a VST in my DW. So I have the music playing back through there. And what I'll do in the Vocaloid 5 editor is simply drag in a phrase, and right now I want to choose something chopped up, and dreamy. I'll choose ah, pop, chopped, and I'll drag this into the editor. Although notice this, the key says G flat, meaning this phrase is playing in the key of G flat major. So when I play this back with the audio, it's not going to fit well with the song. And here's why. Right now, this song is playing three different chords. A flat major seven, F minor nine, and G minor seven. So whether this phrase is in the correct key or not, it's not 100% guaranteed to fit with each of these chords. Although, we can fix this. I'll simply choose A flat major, because the first chord is playing an A flat major chord. And I'll drag this into the project. And it works. This tip works really well for both major and minor chords. So here's how we apply this idea to the whole phrase. I'll simply cut this part with the scissor tool and only use this transpose part for this chord. Then on the next chord, I'll transpose this to an F minor because this chord is playing an F minor chord, and I'll only cut out the section with the second chord playing. And I'll do it one more time with the third chord, a G minor chord. So I'll choose G minor, and I'll cut out the end of that. And this is what we get. You can hear it all works, and all we need to do is simply highlight all of these parts, secondary click, and choose Join Vocaloid Parts. And these will all be combined into a single part now. And from here we can edit this phrase as much as we like. I can delete the dynamic movements from the phrase to smooth it out. delete some of these notes to change the melody. I can rewrite some of the lyrics to bring a new tone to this whole phrase. I'll change the A to an O. And I'll extend this across two notes with a dash. can adjust the release effect to soften these notes a bit more as well. I'll highlight all the notes and choose a decrescendo effect. And from here, I can customize the style as well. I'll simply add some more breathness to this, humanize the sound a bit. And this is what we have.
It's really as simple as that. You can try this out on all the other Vocaloid phrases in the media library. I hope this tip can help you out. This Vocaloid 5 project is available for free download on the Vocaloid website. Head over there to pick it up and learn more about Vocaloid 5.